What's up good people, welcome back to the channel. We're going to quickly jump into Shiba Inu, which has been a massive disappointment for most holders. As you can see, looking at Shiba Inu, looks pretty good on the day, but as soon as you click that one year mark, well, it's still got a long way to pave back to a full on recovery of $21 billion on the market cap. It needs to move another 2x and that's going to require a lot of strength from the balls a lot of patience a lot of fomo and a ton of volume and liquidity but for sure we can see that this week is very good for shiba it's up like 20 percent overall and fingers crossed we're going to get some nice continuation as we can see bitcoin also nearly very very nearly at an all-time high i think bitcoin will break for the all-time high today in fact and yeah by tomorrow i think we'll see like a 74 75k bitcoin so it's looking really really good the plan is following through and this is exactly what we want to see bitcoin creating a new all-time high screw the freaking banks right now this is where i'm keeping my money i'm keeping my things in the crypto space if i want to um but yeah look how beautiful the markets look guys fantastic to, to all the holders anyone that got in 2019 congrats anyone that was in 2021 bear market congrats and yeah anyone that's been holding also massive congratulations to you deserve every drop of this so let's have a look you can see shiba inu of course there's a long way to go to get back to its recent local uh, high which is over here at 0.000045 looking at the charts at the moment we can see we are nowhere near being overbought on that daily rsi so there's still a lot of room to the upside for shiba inu in my honest opinion and uh, i think we do have a good shot now because we can see a massive amount of support is written in that one five region but we have a good shot at making a pave to 0 0.00002 again this would be a really ideal area to see shiba inu get back to because this is a key resistance but at the same time it's a big barrier right and we've tried to get through it once before back in september big rejection now we've been consolidating for a long time and the last time we had a major consolidation period was actually in september which followed up with a 67 percent pump to the upside so if we can replicate something similar then you know we are looking at actually roughly that 0 0.000027 region. I do think we can see Shiba Inu get back there just above that 1.618 Fibonacci. So be on the lookout for it if you want to buy Shiba Inu. Of course, that's entirely up to you. This is not financial advice, but I think Shiba Inu at the moment, you know, meme coins are waking up. And with Bitcoin, if it continues, alt season, meme season should also pick back up. We are seeing a ton of memes go wild at the moment. And it does make you question, well, is the meme coin market coming back? And to be honest, when you look at the valuation of memes over the year i mean this is pretty solid evidence to me that we are indeed waking up and this could be the strongest meme coin wave that we have ever seen 65 billion dollars right now that is something we can compare back to march and also may of 2024 so this is really really interesting to me really really interesting what else is happening in the markets well there's a few cool things that i want to talk about i mean shiba inu for, for me personally i'm not really going to buy it but if you want to buy it that's up to you i'm not a fan of it because the market cap is too large already uh, guys if you also want to get some sick trading signals make sure you check out jacob's crypto clan down below we've got education courses insights indicators we've got the whole lot to help you guys make more money in these markets you can either use the wop store which is now linked down below for you guys or you can check out jacob's crypto clan on my patreon side i've only got three crypto legend slots remaining so if you do want to make money in this market and actually grow your crypto portfolio at the same time as well as achieving time location freedom then check it all out down below now this is pretty cool Firstly, I wanted to show you this clip here from Donald Trump. For too long, our government has violated the cardinal rule that every Bitcoiner knows by heart. Never sell your Bitcoin, right? Never, never, never sell your Bitcoin. That is coming from Donald Trump. That's why we need Trump to win this election. He is Bitcoin heavy, I think. He loves crypto. He is for the people. He wants crypto to survive and he wants to keep business owners onshore because at the moment everyone's having to leave america because of the bureaucracy around it so fingers crossed he will lead bitcoin into the six figures sort of mark that could be absolutely humongous speaking of that we've also got this new coin that went live i saw this one literally just researching a few weeks ago and i was just looking at politify tokens this is a new politify term which is like where politics speaks 
decentralized finance, but it could also be a cool ICO to potentially look at. Now, what makes this bullish is that the pre-sale has raised $341,000, but when you look at the pre-sale stages, you can see this stage one, the starting price is 0 0.00005 per token, but the stage four is 0 0.000125 per token. This means that effectively just buying like now versus stage four gives you a 2x plus on the launch price, at least if it launches at that level, but you're gonna get 2x more tokens than people that are getting in late. So just based on that alone, I think that's very cool. The ecosystem is awesome. It's Kamala versus Donald Trump. And I think honestly, the utility is also pretty good as well. So check it out down below. You can see here there's 54 billion tokens, 20% uh, going to the LP, 40% are being sold in this pre-sale. And yeah, the artwork, the graphics, the imagery, it's all really fun. You can also stake on this one, actually. There's a massive APY with the, the Karma Cop versus Margatron, but it depends what you want to do and how you want to play this one. I will leave a link down below for you guys. 1,400 followers at the moment, um, but yeah, they're growing slowly and they are pushing you know every single day to try and become that next big Politify token. The link is down below for this coin. If you want to research it, do have a little look. So that's about wrap with this video, guys. I think, you know, Shiba Inu, in my honest opinion, just to talk about Shiba Inu, it's not one that gives me that 5X factor anymore. I do think Shiba Inu is a little bit boring, but it's up there and, you know, it's of course still one of the biggest meme coins, but the only time for me that is worth buying Shiba Inu is at the heart or the core of a bear market where things are truly done and dusted and just absolutely boring. So it's really, really interesting to see these large caps. Also, it's interesting to see just looking at the valuation of meme coins, like the meme market is 65 billion. But if you look at the meme market back here in March, where it was 68 billion, this is also where Shiba was doing its thing, right? in March. As we can see, it was March where Shiba was $20 billion on the market capital. But now we actually have memes valued at 68 or 65 billion, which is basically the same as then, but Shiba Inu is half the value. So the meme market has recovered, but Shiba Inu has not recovered. So that's what I'm seeing from this. I don't know if other people are getting that insight, but that's telling me that money isn't going into these massive top meme coins now. It's going into Pump Fund, it's going into Solana, it's going into other tokens. It's not moving as heavily into ERC tokens at the moment. So that's a wrap, guys. Subscribe, like this video if you are new here. I'll see you very soon. Peace.